Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to tell you about OBS software. And if you are here, you already have a problem of recording blank screen while you are probably trying to stream or record your desktop. So no worries. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix that exact problem. Before we start, here is a request. Please subscribe to the channel. And also, if the video helps you, please give it a like. Okay, so let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is click on start and then click on the settings. Once you are here, you will be seeing something like a windows settings and it will list down basically all the items like system accounts and other stuffs. We have to do a search and we have to search for graphics settings. So just go ahead and type in in the search box on top graphics g r a p h i c s you will probably see graphic settings already in the suggestion box once you see it just click on it now the next thing will be graphics performance preference and here is what you have to do i already have obs set studio setup done here because otherwise i would not have been able to record this video but I'm going to show you how you can basically do it for yourself. So please ensure when it says choose an app to set preference, classic app is selected. Once that is done, you need to click on the browse button. Here we are trying to find OBS Studio application. So if you have gone with the default installation, the application lies in C program files OBS studio bin 64 bit and OBS 64 exe just click on that and click on add in my case it is showing specified app was already added because I obviously did the tweak but in your case you will just see this entry click on it and it will expand now we are trying to change something here so click on options by default it will be system default we have to do power savings in this case the problem happened because i apparently have two gpus one is intel hd graphics and other one is amd radian hd 7700m this is a pretty old laptop i have never faced this problem but in this case i guess it's good I faced this problem so I was able to finally find a solution and share it with you guys as well. So yeah, so it is kind of confused right now which graphic settings to use and the system default is not really doing a good job. So what we will do is we will change the set graphics preference from system default to power savings and then click on the save button. That's pretty much it. So we are just telling the system you go ahead and use the GPU which is Intel HD Graphics 4000 and don't worry too much about AMD Radeon HD 7700M. Now the confusing fact here is I only have one HDMI port so I don't really know which GPU and, and when it is being used basically. So in this case power savings click on save and it is pretty much done. So once that is done just close this particular window and settings wise you are all good to go. If you do not see the changes Close the OBS software, relaunch it. If you still don't see the changes, restart your computer. Like all the IT admins always say that. So in my case, I had to restart my computer and that did the trick. So the next time I opened after restarting, OBS was perfectly showing me the desktop screen and my recordings were just fine. Like you see in this case, I'm recording. This is the first video after I fixed this problem. So I hope this helps and again as I said earlier if it did please give me a subscribe and also like this particular video. I don't mind if you if you share it with your friends as well. So feel free to do that too. And yeah thank you so much for watching and you have a great day. I hope to see you again. Bye bye.